Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Excel VBA Expert. In today's video, we will be learning the very unique question of a VBA. All right. Uh, I hope you have understood what we are going to learn because already I have you know written here. Okay, but uh, about which topic we are going to talk about about which topic we are going to talking about. All right. So here, what we are going to learn here, we will be learning how we can reply on the trail mail. Okay, with all the communication. So in what happen? Okay, I have tried, and even people try to when people try to you know replying. Okay, on the mail. Okay, with all the communication. All right. So what happen? When manual when we reply. See, let me show you my output here. I do have it. If I will click on reply. So what will be happening? Okay, whatever the communication already the person has uh, you know had with me. All right. So th that will come. Okay, on the bottom side. Okay, and the latest reply what we I am going to do I will do like this. Uh, hi, okay, up to PFA for example. So what is happening here? You guys can see. So at the moment I will click on send. Okay, so you know as it is this mail body will remain same, remain same. All right, but 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 through VBA when I am doing it. So what it is doing? Okay, so it is basically you know. Removing this part and only sending only this one. Hi, Aku PFA. All right, this is what. Okay, uh, the you would you can also tell the separate sending email is basically sending to that particular email. All right. So how we can reply on the trail mail? All right. With the uh, at the moment we are replying through the coding. So whatever the communication already we had what with that particular person. All right, all those things also should come on the bottom one. Okay, wherein I will be replying. All right. For example, I have already you know it's my latest reply which I am going to reply to Aku. But whatever the communication, whatever the Aku you know was written to me, all those things should come on the bottom. This is how we need to reply. All right. So I am discarding it. So through VBA, okay, initial what I was trying to do is if I will press Alt F one. I pressed here. Let me add one module. Alt I am. Initially, you guys can see. Uh, I am writing. Let's start to ops. I am going to write my code in option explicit mode. Subject uh, first try for example. First try. All right. Here I would need the one external library of uh, VBA, which would be the Microsoft. Outlook 16.0. All right. You need to go on tools. Click on references. Here I have already checked my Microsoft Outlook 6.0 object library. You need to click on OK. Here. Here, what do you have? You have to just write only few lines of the code. OT to what? Dim OT as new Outlook dot application. Dim OML as Outlook dot mail icon. Right. Only these two variable only you need to declare. All right. No, apart from that, we need more variable like team OMS as output dot namespace because we need to specify a folder as well, right? So for a folder, we have to create FLDR folder dot output dot folder. All right. Next, what we have to do now? I have already, you know, set my dim OT as a new output. All right. So what I have, I need to set set OMS OT dot get namespace, and it will be the static M A P I M A P. You have to write in this way. After that, I need to specify my folder. Folder. Okay. OMS dot get default folder. Okay. Folder would be in box. Inside the inbox, I have created my one more folder by the name of Nokri. All right. All right. Next, next, what we have to do? We need to run the loop here for each. We need to set OML as well, mail item. OML folder. Sorry. Forty dot create item. Well, mail item. All right. Here I need to run the loop. Okay, in each item for each OML in whatever the emails we have, okay, in this particular folder, okay, it's for each. Okay, this loop should run there, right? Next one. 
here uh, i want to you know uh, reply only on those mail which contains the excel vb export all right otherwise reply should not uh, reply should not you know send to on every mail if oml dot subject would be like to excel vb export then what should happen it should uh, reply oml dot reply and not reply all and after that i would to keep oml dot to okay whatever ot dot to sorry oml dot to but whoever send us right whoever sender email address right whoever send us okay that person should be on to and after that i would uh, write my body uh your bracket hi okay and your your please find the attached data center attached data and after that i want to give my signature as well so here i would write uh current sorry session dot current user all right we are dot after that what i i want to display on okay i don't want to send for example as of now so what it will do let's i am going to run it one by one okay i have not and if let's start and if all right Okay, it is gone. It's fine. It's replying to that particular mail, keeping okay in the two, drafting my HTML body, and now it's going to display. Me. All right, it will display. It will display me in this way. All right. So here you guys can see what is happening. It is showing okay whatever reply I am going to share to the particular email address who sent us right. So you guys can see whatever the communication, old communication data, all communication we do not have in this particular email which we are going to share, right? So we have written okay in the coding. If you will notice, hi, hi, please find the attached data, and after that current user. I mean it's my signature. All right. So this is what only showing the latest reply which I am going to share. So it will be you know considering as a separate mail from that, okay, separate mail from that uh, trail mail, okay, on which we replied, right? But what I want here, I want my old communication as well, which should be reflect, uh, you know, uh, blow my latest reply. All right. So what I will be doing, I will be cancelling it. Okay. And will what we what I will do, I will do copy and paste it. Okay. Okay. This is the wrong way. Okay. Uh, you know, through this code only we can reply separately. Okay. We would not have the trail. Communication, okay, whatever the communication we had so far. All right, so here we need to declare. Here we need to only add one thing. You guys can see OML dot uh, dot HTML body. Here, what I want, I have to, you know, uh, I have to here add one more thing. OML dot HTML body. Just okay. Yeah, whatever OML dot HTML body. All right. Here I would be declaring one more variable here. Here, then OML dot. I think I have made something mistake. I believe no. Right. Okay. Let's now reply. I would send directly. All right. Why it's not happening? A syntax I'm not getting. The sub procedure name I have kept the same just because of that nothing was happening. All right, now what I am going to do? I am going to reply and in my sent item you guys can see I do not have. Okay, uh, I have the last email which I had sent okay on Wednesday, right? So I do not have any latest. You know, when I have this one, this one. Sorry, two. All right, for the uh, for the you know example that I have you know replied to myself. Okay, that only on those emails we are going to work. Okay, those emails I have because these emails I you know move to the Nokri folder. Okay.
okay this one i am going to reply on this particular on both this uh, email all right whatever the uh, old communication whatever the reply okay i have sent to myself those should, those reply should come on the bottom okay or you may also say the blow under my latest reply all right so i have done everything i am going to run it my final code what we have only just add to this line once more okay in your same line oml dot ast all right i did did all right great send i sent all right i sent now here it should get uh, reflect in my send icon i had only two here uh, mail is about to come all right let it come you guys can see it is coming okay but now you guys uh, you noticed here you just you can observe here this is my latest reply and this is my old reply am i right this is my old reply correct so this is how you can reply on the trail mail okay using this code even this code i will give you in the description box as well you can take it and you may use it okay in a daily task and definitely the lot of people are actually not aware how we can reply on the trail mail all right so i will copy it and will uh, paste in the description box from there that you can take it and you can use it okay uh, for your uh, daily task all right or you can use it in your project as well if you are working on any all right so apart from that if you think okay uh, there should be more addition in this question you can let me know i will definitely make the video on those uh, you know topics as well which you would be suggesting all right great thank you so much everyone uh, you know to watching this video thanks a lot bye bye take care